Mm -hmm. I'm Orion Burns, and I'm here with Deborah Miller, and we're here to show you her baby, the Folded Star Hot Pad. Yeah, I'd love to tell you about it. It comes in round or square. We have a pattern for each, and inside of each pattern is the interfacing template. Plus, we have refills. I want you to see and, this. And is this the secret? This is the secret because this is a ruler and a foundation. You leave it in and build your hot pad right on top of it, and then you sew it together once it's all uh, pieced. Oh, wow. And then so we're using prairie points, right? We are, and a prairie point is nothing more than what we used to call a paper airplane. You take a square, you fold it in half, and then fold the edges down, press it, and that's your prairie point, and that's the thing that's gonna make the diamond of the hot pad. And so we're going to start off with this one in the center, right? Right. And the first thing you do is a, a little piece that we're going to put right in the middle to cover the template because we leave it in. And then we're going to put four prairie points together in the middle. And then we're going to go to layer two. And you can see these here. There's four layers. And we start in the middle and work out. So let's build that star. Yes. Layer one has four prairie points. So now that we've added the four prairie points on to round two, we've added eight prairie points around the circle to make a star. On to round three, we've added eight more prairie points and it's getting a little bit more complex. This is the fourth and final layer and she's using her focus fabric to finish it off. So we finished our circle and now we can make it square and I'll show you how. The uh, four corners have a folded square in place of the regular prairie point, and it's this easy. And then you would go ahead and finish it like normal, and it's the way you do it. And that was plum easy. Yes, it is. Thank you, Deborah. You're welcome. For more videos, you can join this channel or visit us on the web at quiltintheday.com.